Today we look at all kinds of weird and wacky Pokemon cards. I'm talking pocket monsters from Japanese sets back in the day, Pokemon cards that are based on famous bits of artwork, a Charizard wearing a top hat. I mean seriously, that says it all. Let's get opening, let's get chasing, and let's find out how wacky these cards really are. Welcome back my Chase family, fellow card chaser here, Pokey Hand, and today we look at all kinds of weird and wacky Pokemon cards. Now these are reproduction cards that you can get online, but I had to get them because seriously, we got Charizard wearing a hat. At first I thought it was a top hat, but it's just a hat. It doesn't matter, it's Charizard wearing a hat. Now, we got ourselves Pocket Monster Japanese cards from back in the day. We got ourselves artwork, Pikachu here from, you know, different kind of artwork. Have not opened these up, have no idea what's in them. We're about to start, let's start off with the old school Japanese Pocket Monster set, shall we? Now, I'm not quite sure how many are in this set or what they exactly look like, but I can't wait. We got ourselves Venusaur there. Obviously, we got ourselves Venusaur with the island here. It looks like the islands there of what the Pallet Town and things like that from the old school Pokemon days, 1995. This is this looks really cool as a reproduction. We got ourselves here, the whole team there. That looks fantastic. That brings back memories, doesn't it? We got ourselves. I don't know. I can't read that. All right. What have we got here? What is this? A weird, weird looking Pikachu. All right, cool holographic. The quality on it is really, really good. We've got our stats back there. We've got a Raichu over there, the Pikachu over there. I'm not quite sure what I'm looking at. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, we've got ourselves Articuno. <coughs> I was choking then. We've got ourselves Articuno there. Fantastic Articuno. Monsters collection. I'm not quite, quite, quite sure what they mean by that. All right, we've got ourselves the old pixel art style there of Articuno. Oh, we got ourselves the fat Pikachu. Look at that, it's fantastic. From Pocket Monsters, the old school. What is it? What is going on there? What is going on there? It looks like the other is on a chopping block, like they're about to eat him. Got ourselves Dragonite there, number 149 from Dragonite. These are pretty cool. It's like the little Pokedex database at the back there, with a little sprite where they look like the moves they have, the stats they have. Alakazam, fantastic card. Really hard to do when you have to trade it and get it. Blastoise. Oh, when I first played Pokemon, I think it was Pokemon Blue, and I picked Blastoise, and I eventually got Pokemon Red and picked Charizard. But I always picked Blastoise first over Charizard back in the day. All right, we've got ourselves the whole team there. It looks fantastic. We've got ourselves Gary right there, or Red or Blue, which depending on which set you pick or which game you pick. Gengar, fantastic Gengar. Oh, that looks a bit creepy there. Oh, Venusaur again. It was, you already had Venusaur, right? Got Moltres. Moltres. It looks looks a bit dopey or asleep in the pixel art there. Tail whip or trying to fart. I'm not quite sure. Maybe it's got the shits. I don't know. Charizard. That looks pretty cool. That Charizard artwork is really cool. Obviously, everyone loves Charizard. Shows you there when they evolve as well. All right. Mutt Champ, my boy. Look at that. Fantastic. Oh, we got ourselves another Charizard, but a different artwork. Charizard. All right, I got it. So the back of it on some of them just shows you when they evolve, what moves they have, things like that. Oh, speaking of Charizard, let's go straight to Charizard wearing the hat, shall we? Oh, yes, I'm excited about this. Obviously, like, I know these are reproduction stuff, but it's just really cool to have because some of these, like, are really good quality. All right, so the back of the card looks like that, which doesn't look too bad, I guess. Because of Charizard with the gray felt hat. I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure what they mean by that. So I don't understand half this artwork. That's one Snorlax with Munchlax and Mew. That looks pretty cool. All right, we've got ourselves Venusaur with the Starry Knight. That's fantastic. Clefairy, Cle Cle Clefairy with the Starry Knight. Oh, Blastoise with the Starry Knight. That looks pretty, that looks pretty creepy. It looks kind of like 3D-ish. All right, that's, yeah, not too bad. Oh, Eevee. Eevee with a straw hat. Fair enough. Or Monopika. Oh, that's Monopika. I mean, okay. Sunflora. Squirtle in a grey felt hat. I'm going to assume like the grey felt hat. Oh, Pikachu looking at his own card in the jungle. Okay, I get where you're going with that. Mewtwo with the starry nights. That looks, that looks creepy. Oh, this looks nice though. Mew, enjoying the moon there. Mew and the moon. Moon and Mew. Mew, Mew. 
All right, Lugia looking up at the moon. Just like that. Yes, I know. Pikachu with the grey felt hat. Just like Charizard with the grey felt hat. All right, Starry Night Pikachu. That looks pretty cool. All right, these feel very thick too. Like, like they feel like they look good and they're clean and they're not really, they're not blurry. They, they feel good. They feel different to other fake cards and things like that that I've opened. But that's because these, they're just trying to, they're trying their best with certain types. They're not trying to go overboard. All right, we've got ourselves another pack here. I'm not sure how many are in here, maybe like 10 or something like that, but this is the last of them. Now these are in Japanese. All right, so we've got ourselves the creepy Pikachu here, screaming away, it's like the screaming face. Oh, I can't remember what it was called, the artwork for that. Oh, this is nightmares. Look at that. Oh, there's Pikachu in the back there, look at that. Oh, 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 and there's Eevee back there. I just realized Eevee's behind Pikachu there. Oh, and there's Eevee, and there's Psyduck. So I guess that, okay, and here's Psyduck. Okay, and he's getting chased by, I assume that's Gengar, and that's Haunter. That's a weird looking Gengar. All right, so we're down to the final card. All right, I didn't think it'd be Rowlet, but it's Rowlet. Look at that. Like Giggle and Hoot, but on drugs. Now, tell me what you think was your favorite card, because I don't know, I'm tossing up between these two here, and then also, Seriously, isn't this adorable? All right, let me know what you think of the cards in the comments below. Until next time, I'll see you in the next chase. Mm -hmm.